hello guys shubham here back again in another video so without any further ado let's get into this so moving towards the system in settings as you can see that i am on the latest version of the no gravity kernel which is of version 1.5.5 this is the latest build from the no gravity kernel which i have flashed on my device so further let me show you that how you can easily flash this kernel on this device right now i am using this kernel in the evolution x rom and it works pretty smooth stable and perfectly fine and just giving out the max out performance at the very first time you have to boot to the recovery of your device after booting into recovery just like you install any other rom you have to click on install and locate the zip you have downloaded which the link i have will provide in the description below right now i have installed this zip so i will not install it but you just have to select and swipe to flash once you done with this you have to go back and reboot back to system so here our system gets rebooted once our system gets rebooted we need here the magisk that is root access in our device having magisk is must so make sure that your phone is rooted via magisk secondly we have to go and navigate to the files and you have to download the apk file which i will be linking down in description and you must install this apk So here our APK get installed. Now here it will it will ask the super user permissions and grant all types of permission whichever it asks. Giving all the desirable permissions as you can see this is the user interface of the applications which includes a ton of settings of CPU, GPU and many more settings such as profiles and much more. At the very first time you have to do one thing that is you have to optimize all of the applications by swiping to the next menu and you will find this. Beware that optimization will take place about 5 to 10 minutes or maybe up to 12 to 15 minutes. So bear with me and have patience. So as you can see we are we got finished with our optimization here notification flashing that optimization has been finished further you have to click on the profiles clicking on the profiles you have to select any of the profile you want which is performance if you want then a better performance battery for battery life gaming and gaming plus right now i am using the gaming plus so that i can able to show you the gaming performance in this kernel so make sure that after setting up profile you reboot your device because changes will take place only after rebooting. So right now as you can see that this is the sample gameplay I am showing you of PUBG. PUBG worked perfectly fine in this kernel and the performance is just super dope. No frame drops were found, no lag or stutters were found and game is just super smooth. Let me tell you that I am running this game on full settings on smooth HDR. Also one thing I like that the touch drivers in this kernel is pretty dope and it's updated to the latest version. So you will not find any kind of touch delay or any other ghost touch issues. It's completely fixed. No teleport issues, no timing issues, everything is perfectly managed by this kernel and this just makes your phone a gaming phone the way it works. It might happen that because of weak signal or weak network, your gameplay might 
the doesn't work the way it must be because the an online game network is very important thing but rather than that if you have good internet connectivity this rom is pretty dope this kernel is pretty dope and it will work perfectly fine Each and every render, rendering of graphics is perfectly fine and no lags not at all were found. While, uh, while driving vehicles, while moving from one place to another, while jumping or doing any other actions, this kernel works perfectly fine. So must consider to flash this kernel and tweak the way you want. Until then, like this video. Subscribe to this channel if you want more such content and I will see you in the next one. Until then, peace out.